In this video, let us continue to solve problems based on nature of roots of quadratic equations. So the question here is uh, find the values of k for which the given equation has real and equal roots. So this is the given equation 2x square minus minus 10x plus k equals 0. They say that the nature of the roots are real and equal. So accordingly, we need to find the value of k. So first of all, let us find out what is a, a equals 2, b equals minus 10 and c equals k right so now for real roots we've got d equals b square minus 4 ac equal to 0 right that's the condition for uh, real and equal roots so now we've got b square b is minus 10 the whole square minus 4 times a is 2 and c is k equal to 0 so minus 10 the whole square is uh, 100 100 minus 8k equals 0 or 8k equals 100 right or k equals 100 divided by 8, which is 4 goes 25 times in 100 and it goes 2 times in 8. So k equals 25 by 2. So the value of k for the given equation, such that the roots are real and equal, is that uh, k equals 25 by 2. So this is how you find the value of k when the nature of the root is mentioned. So let's quickly solve another problem before we conclude this video. So we've got 12x squared plus 4kx plus 3 equals 0. It's clearly mentioned that the roots are real and equal. So definitely, you know, the d that is the determinant b squared minus 4ac should be equal to 0. So here we have a equals 12 and b equals 4k and c equals 3. So b squared is uh, 4k the whole square minus 4 times a is 12 times c is 3. So this should be equal to 0. So this is 4 squared is 16, k squared is k square minus uh, 4 times 3 is 12, 12 times 12 is 144 equals 0 or 16 k square equals 144 or k square equals 144 by 16 which is 16 goes 9 times and 144. So we've got k square equals 9. So we've got k equals plus or minus root 9. So therefore k equals plus 3 or minus 3. So the values of k has to be a positive 3 or a negative 3. So that's all that there is to do on uh, based, you know, uh, as far as the problems like these are concerned. Once the nature of the roots is given, you can definitely find the roots or uh, the unknown that is uh, mentioned in the given equation. In this case, it was C and in this case, it was uh, B, part of B. So that, that, that K is positive 3 or negative 3. So this ends this video. I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with more problems based on nature of roots of quadratic equations.